Hi guys, we're here today at the Game of Thrones studio tour in Bambridge, Northern Ireland. Let's take a look. The Game of Thrones studio tour opened in February 2022, celebrating HBO's globally acclaimed and award-winning TV series, Game of Thrones. As a Game of Thrones fan, I just couldn't wait to get down. And I know after watching this video, you're gonna feel the same. The tour commences with a really cool green screen photo opportunity with photos available at the end of the tour with use of your very own Valerian Steel card, complete with a QR code so you can access the photos online. Following this, you're going to immerse yourself beyond the wall. Here you will see some amazing costumes from the show and really gain some perspective as to how tall one one really was. The actor who played him was actually over seven foot tall and it took three to five hours each day to transform him. An interesting perspective of the tour comes next, the production and design. Here you can see the core beginnings of the set design and look at plans for different sets via the interactive screens. The tour quickly transitions to the moody set of the Night's Watch, with the Commander's Table to your right and the Commander's Chamber to your left. One thing we loved about this tour was the activities throughout. As you can see here, I designed my very own sigil. Another cool thing about the tour is there's always a tour guide around to give a cool insider knowledge on the sets and it really elevates the experience, especially because all of these tour guides are huge Game of Thrones fans and they really know their stuff. Although you cannot touch any of the other sets, you can take a selfie in the crypt with some iconic characters. One of my favourite sets in the whole tour has to be the Great Hall of Winterfell. The tour guide here was informing me of how this set has actually remained situated here from season 2 onwards with very few changes. This room features costumes worn by iconic characters such as Arya, Bran and my personal favourite, Brienne of Tarth. This is the original map table featured in the series, which is 5 metres long and carved in clay. No details were overlooked in this design, with molten copper used for the roads and emeralds for the trees to make everything visible even in a dim light. The tower includes a sculpture of Beleriand the Dread, the greatest and largest dragon. His head alone is 9.1 metres long, 3.4 metres high and 4.9 metres wide. It took five sculptures to create it. All of the costumes used in the tour are the originals and the tour provides insight into how these were fully realised. There is no shortage of interactive activities to get involved in on this tour. This one shows the stages of visual effects including the wireframing and clay modelling process the whole way to the finished product. The tour also features some extremely realistic wax figures including these two of Jamie and Cersei Lannister. Next, enter the Hall of Faces, where you have the opportunity to put your face there also. This set was constructed in Belfast with over 600 unique face masks representing both men and women of all cultures. They even used crew members' faces as inspiration. The weapon room features iconic weapons from the show such as Needle and Jon Snow's famous sword, Longclaw. After learning about these weapons, you can test your very own archery skills by getting involved in the interactive White Walker game. The map courtyard within the Red Keep was created by graphic designer Jim Staines, who actually appeared in a cameo in Season 7 where he appeared to be painting the map before Cersei dismissed him. The tour finishes off with the throne room, which is truly breathtaking. The room features the original Iron Throne, which has some interesting swords integrated into it, including Gandalf's sword. After the tour, why not treat yourself to some exclusive Game of Thrones studio tour merch? And don't forget to get your photos from the green screen. Alright guys, there you have it. That was the Game of Thrones studio tour. If you're a fan of Game of Thrones, you need to get yourself down here, but make sure you book your tickets in advance on the website. And if you enjoyed our video, please like and follow our pages and subscribe to our YouTube channel.